Friends, we are here to celebrate Wesley and Mackenzie, the beginning of their journey as husband and wife. I am so fortunate to have met Mackenzie because she made going from a school of 300 people per class to 3,000 people per class so easy because I could count on her to be there for me, especially while attending Carolina football games together. Okay, Wesley, I had the pleasure of teaching him for some time in sixth grade, and he was a nice young man back then, and little did I know that he would end up being one of our son-in-laws in our family. But we welcome you to our family. We love you, and we want to welcome you, and thank you for taking care of Mackenzie. Take thee, Wesley, to be my wedded husband, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better or worse, for rich or poor, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, to death do us part. Now, oh, Wesley, take thee, Mackenzie, to be my wedded wife, to have and to hold from this day forward. Better for worse, for richer, for poor, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, to death to his part. Mackenzie, I want you to know how important you are to me and I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you as your husband. Love, Wesley. Now, if you want to, you may kiss your bride. Wesley, I know you're going to be the luckiest guy in the world having the best roommate ever. I sure do miss having her as my roommate, and any time you want to give her back to me over the weekend, I will gladly accept her. <laughs> and Wesley, just remember that she is the baby, and she will always be the baby, so you better take very good care of her. I know it seems like we have a really big family already, but adding Wesley's family is just, you know, another icing on the cake. And we really welcome you into our family and welcome your family into our family. We're so grateful to have everybody here tonight. Thank you. 